What's up everybody? I'm here with another tutorial to show you how to use your justice cam and to be able to stream it live to your Facebook or your uh, YouTube social media page. Um, so the first thing you're going to need to do is you're going to go to your iPhone or uh, whatever smartphone you have. And what I have here is a iPhone uh, 6S Plus. And I'm just gonna go to the App Store. I'm gonna download the app. It's called Stream. Um, excuse me. The name of the app is called Omelet Arcade. And you're gonna wanna download that to your phone. Then you want to open the app up. It's going to take you through the process of um, registering and doing all that. So you're just going to enter in your email address and um, create a password and all of that good stuff. So I've already did all of that. But when you're a first time user of this app, it'll um, take you through the process of uh, entering in that information. So once you've fully registered, and um, you're inside the Omelette Arcade app, uh, what you wanna do is click on this plus button here and you wanna click on go live. Uh, this is just giving you instructions here saying make sure um, the iOS stream feature is enabled. Um, you're gonna swipe up the control center to check if the recording button is present, if not, uh, and then it's going to lead you through some steps that you need to follow to enable that. So if you're on an iPhone, all you're going to do is just swipe up like that and you'll see that button. That's what's going to help you to stream uh, to Arm Omelette Arcade and to your social media page. If you have another type of phone, uh, like an Android, uh, you'll just have to um, uh, use your Android um, settings uh, to be able to um, stream live. Uh, using the Omelette Arcade, but right now we're just going to do this on the iPhone. So down here, I'm going to click on, I'm going to slide over. So this is, again, this is just showing you step one. You're going to open the settings and go to the control center um, on your iPhone. Step three, open the customized controls and add the screen recording uh, to the list. And that's what that is right there. I know it's kind of hard to see. But yeah, where that little arrow is at, and that's the screen recording button. All right. So I'm gonna click on a got it right here. That's gonna close that out. Again, that's just a, a screen here saying if you um ready for your best live stream, invite your friends to join. Um, I usually just um, skip this part right here and I click continue um, right here. All right, and this screen here, it's um, asking you uh, what uh, social media platform do you want to stream to? Uh, so what I want to do is I'm going to stream to Facebook, um, but it gives you other options. You can stream to YouTube. You can stream to uh, Twitch as well. So today we're going to do uh, Facebook. So um, I'm going to just go ahead and enter in uh, my Facebook uh, email address as well as my password and I'm gonna just um, I'm not going to show that part, but I'll enter that in real quick Just give me a moment to enter all that information in All right, so after you enter your uh, Facebook uh, username and password It's gonna take you to this screen and it's just saying Omelet Arcade would like to post content publicly to your timeline on your behalf um, who can see Omelette Arcade's post on your timeline. Um, right now, I'm just going to set this to public, um, but it also gives you the option if you only want to add friends, only yourself or close friends. Uh, and this is an important feature to know. Uh, for example, uh, for the safety, I have a, I have a customer that um, um, it's a, um, 
a lady that's married and her husband wants to be able to make sure that she's safe like when she gets off of work late at night or whatnot and all you need to do if you uh, for the safety feature to be able to use your justice cam with this you just want to click on um, don't click on public but just click on um, like close friends and then you can be able to just add uh, your specific loved one that you would like uh, to be able to view the video footage coming from the justice cam but right now we're just going to do public and i'm going to click ok <clears throat> all right and um now it see it shows that i am uh, connected to facebook and i'm going to click next This again is asking to change your Omelet Arcade post settings to public in order to receive all your audience chat messages. Um, that's not really um, necessary right now, so I'm just gonna put, I don't want to do that. And here it's just asking you like, what game do you wanna um, stream? Um, because Omelet Arcade is, is usually just uh, used with um, games but we're using it with the justice cam uh, so all i'm going to do is just click done okay so it looks like it's asking us so you can just enter in any uh, game here i'm just going to click on minecraft done got it all right so it, it requires you to enter um, a game, but you can choose any game there. We're not going to be streaming any games, and we're just going to be streaming the uh, the Justice Cam. So on this uh, screen here again, it's just saying make sure your microphone audio is switched on, and um, it gives you um, example of the screen that you'll see here when we're ready to go live. Um, here, this says microphone is on. Uh, chatting with your viewers will help you get more fans. Uh, so that's what that is saying right now. So I'm just going to click on, um, I got it. And here, if I want to, I can either start uh, live streaming um, from here um, by putting a start button, um, but I'm not going to um, do that right now. Um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to hit my home button on my phone and I'm just going to go back to my home screen on my iPhone right now. So the next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to get the Justice Cam. I'm going to turn the Justice Cam on. You know it's on because the blue light comes on. What I'm going to do now is connect the Justice Cam to the iPhone. So you're going to have to hit your Wi-Fi button right here on your Justice Cam. Hit it really quick, click, click. You're gonna see the green light comes on now. Green light is flashing. Uh, that means you've activated the Wi-Fi signal on a Justice Cam. Uh, now what we're gonna do is we're gonna go to our um, iPhone and go to the settings. After you click on settings, you're gonna go to um, Wi-Fi. And then you're going to find a Justice Cam uh, signal here. And you're going to click on that. When you see the check mark on your phone, uh, that means the Justice Cam is connected. And also, as you can see, the green light has stopped blinking. It's uh, gone solid now. So that means the Justice Cam is connected uh, to your smartphone. So I'm going to go back to my home screen. Uh, now I'm going to go to the DV Runnings 2 app. And as you can see, I'm getting a live stream coming from the Justice Cam to the iPhone. A live preview here. So what we want to do with this live preview, we want to be able to stream this live preview to our social media page um, so if we want either our loved one to see us being safe while we're out or 
you can allow uh, multiple people, you can allow your um, stream to be public so everybody on Facebook can see it. If you really in a dangerous situation, you just want everybody to see it, you can do that as well. So right now, I am going to swipe up on my iPhone from the bottom. And this is the instructions, you know, we saw uh, on the Omnit Arcade screen. So I'm going to hit the record button. It's right here. I'm just going to hold it down for two seconds. And it says I can start recording right there. So I'm going to scroll down and find the Omelette Arcade. I'm going to click on that. And then I'm going to click on Start Broadcast. It's going to count down here. And it's saying Omelet Arcade would like to send you notifications. I'm just going to hit allow. And right now it's recording. You see the red record button right there. I'm getting a little bit of feedback, so I'm just going to turn the volume down on the iPhone. And there you go. So I'm getting a live preview coming from the Justice Cam. It's being seen on my iPhone, on the DV Running 2 app, as well as this is being streamed through Omelette Arcade to my Facebook page. And you know that it's uh, recording and streaming because you can see the on the iPhone, uh, the red uh, recording going on at the top here. And that's how you do it. That's how you stream to your uh, social media page. You can do it to, again, Facebook, YouTube, or Twitch. If I go to my uh, personal Facebook page, it will um, show that I have a live stream going on. Let's see if we can do that. And as you can see right there, it's showing uh, me live right now. And um, it's saying that watch me play Minecraft. I'm not playing Minecraft. We're streaming live with the Justice Cam. But as you know, the uh, Omelet Arcade, it um, forces you to choose what game you're playing. We're not playing a game. We're just streaming with the Justice Cam. And this is the live view, as you can see um, right now. Um, that we um, previously did. That's the live on Facebook. Now, you probably can see um, that the picture that we're getting right there is um, actually um, a horizontal. So that's really easy to uh, fix. Um, for example, if you go back to your DV Runnings 2, all you have to do is hit on that button right there. And that gives you um, a horizontal picture. So when you're uh, streaming to Facebook, it'll be oriented properly um, when you click on that. So what we're gonna do right now is we're just gonna go back uh, to Facebook. And that's, as you can see, we just recorded that right there. It's um, flipped in the right direction because we did that, um, hit that button. So I appreciate everybody for watching. Uh, that is how you stream the Justice Cam using Omelette Arcade to Facebook. Um, I hope this tutorial helped. Uh, let me know if you have any questions. Uh, leave a comment uh, down below. And um, I hope you all uh, will be blessed and be safe. And thank you for supporting Justice Cam. Bye-bye. Take care.